Hello everybody, welcome back to Hermitcraft. Apparently it's been a very, very busy week. Um, because I have got so many weird comments. Now, this is the place that I logged off. Um, I did see something out the window. If we look this way, you can just about sort of see it when I logged on. I know that I've been pranked and I know it was by Impulse and it was by Doc and it was by Ren because people have told me that and they said it's at my pirate ship so I am here and yeah I need to do something with this pirate ship so that's why I'm here I've also been getting some um other kinds of comments and ignore the cat in the background having a funny five minutes um yeah telling me something about Grin right I want to make this clear this is the first time I've logged on the server for like since like Sunday so um yeah, I have no idea what's going on. So we're going to start with the uh, prank by Doc, Ren and Impulse. Impulse, I am surprised at you. I just finished fixing your building that was exploded through no fault of my own. I am <laughs> obviously shocked and appalled, Impulse. Um, so, yeah, I, I guess we're going to go and uh, have a look at... Like, what's going on? So, oh. <laughs> okay, guys, way to uh, outclass me on my own vessel. Thanks for that. Yeah, appreciate it. I do need to decorate the ship. I know. It's just I've, I've found other things to do. And I don't have a huge amount of time. But yes, okay. Yeah, well done, guys. Well done. Right, so there's some kind of ghost ship going on. And... What? Oh, is this why I'm getting hate for Green? Um, hate for Green? From Green? Not from Green. Green's pretty chill with me. Um, this way for your treasure. Are you guys breaking in? Like, seriously, we have like a cargo. Actually, it's this. A cargo thing. Maybe not this side. Oh, excuse me. Sneezing fit. Sorry. I am sick. You can probably hear that in my voice, actually. So, Green, this way for your treasure. Okay. I know this was for me because I've been told it was for me. <laughs> okay, someone's changing sides and it's not me. I've... <laughs> someone's playing dress up in Big Sister's shoes. Okay, so there's... Oh, ghost pirates. I... That makes sense. Um, try to get it back from our crusty crew. Well, there's nothing in the chest, but yeah, okay. Ow. That's a sneaky <laughs> I have to say I do like the ship. The ship's pretty cool. Um I I it, it's it's, <laughs> it's easy to decorate something when you don't have to think about like um what you call it? Uh let's see what's up, up on the top deck. Uh, furniture is the word I was looking for, but obviously failed at. Okay, a ghost pirate with a head, but no arms. <laughs> Makes sense, okay. Um, right, let me think. Okay, so spin the key. Loot cat... Well, okay. Well, there's no key. This has already been triggered, hasn't it? <laughs> This is, this is a redstone thing. Hang on, do I have blocks? I do have blocks. I have, I'll, I'll take the oak planks. Um, okay, so what's going on here then? Right, so let's make our way down. Right, so, pressure. Okay, that, that was pistons nothing in the dis nothing in any of the dispensers whoa right so there was supposed to be something in there and the dispensers were supposed to shoot something i i i, I don't know um well Okay, so this has already been triggered. So I'm assuming 
something get fired at you, got, got, get fired at you, got fired at you, and then released from, okay, so you go down, something gets fired at you from the dispensers, something was released, and, and then what, and, and then you die, okay, that's a pretty harsh for changing a sign, guys, though so what's happened i don't what has happened okay so has green triggered this ah okay i deserve that i, I actually deserve that has green triggered this because it says green and i know this was meant for me hang on let's just uh let's just take a, a little bit of a, a a quick tour of the ship that's not a rocket. That's a rocket. <laughs> That's awesome. But again, <laughs> way to outdo me at my own base, guys. <laughs> um, okay. Well, Ren, I kind of deserved it from. Doc, I kind of expected it from. But Impulse? What have I ever done to Impulse? It's harsh, dudes. Harsh. Okay, so... Yes, I need to grab a posse of some description. Oh, yeah, we're, we're counter-pranking, by the way. Um, I'm going to counter-prank Impulse because everyone else I sort of expect it from. But Impulse, of all people. No, 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 no. That will not stand. All right, I do know where my stuff is. At least they did tell me that. They don't steal, steal my stuff. They just stole it. Um, yeah, it's all in here. Um, so that's grand. So I know, <clears throat> sorry, again, sick. Um, so I know I'm going to transport all this stuff back to my base. And one of my shulker boxes, I think, is in the hands of one of their pirates. Yeah, I think so. Um, so, okay. Right. Ow. That failed. There you go. Um, hmm. Very, very concerned. It's time to gather supplies and friends. Howdy, y'all. Joe Hills here, recording as I was doing in Nashville, Tennessee, and I'm joined today by Zombie Cleo, which, Zombie Cleo, you woke me up early enough to go to the airport to come to your boat. What's going on? Uh, I, I need your help. I need someone to make it weird. And that's, that's always you in this world. <laughs> It's already weird. I'm here. I woke up at 5.30 for this. How can we make it unpleasant for others the same way it's unpleasant for me? I'm assuming this is somebody's fault, and I would like it to not be yours because you are my friend. Okay, so um, it's Impulse and Ren's and Doc's fault. Because if you, you, well, you saw on the way in, I'm assuming, the giant ghost ship. I got oh. pranked. I got pranked so hard. Except I didn't get pranked. They pranked. Come look at this sign. Okay. They. they I'm literate. They. Someone's pranked Grian. They've pranked me, but I didn't get here. Grian's been pranked in my stead, and I know who it was because people in my comments have told me so. Yeah, um, Ren pranked me in retaliation for the sign. That's fine, but. Yeah, they were going to kill me, dude. I changed okay. one sign and they were going to kill me. <laughs> yeah, a sign is fine, but death is not the best. <laughs> to say the least. Yeah, so from what I can gather, um, out, watch the thing. Down here okay. was a death chamber. Um, I put the stairs down. And um, yeah, something came out of the dispensers and there were mobs, I think, in here to murder me and the stairs weren't here obviously i added those so okay so somebody built a death chamber mm -hmm. and you can and... see that the the, the 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 stones there was something there they were going to release to kill me i'm assuming mm -hmm. so... no that's a, that's a safe bet okay so um what's your plan to help these people learn the error of their ways <laughs> well um 
I mean, obviously, we should just talk to them directly and try to understand the cause of this conflict. It seems like there's oh. a lot of misunderstandings oh, oh, going oh, on. Or oh, what we could do instead is we could prank them. That's almost like talking to them directly. Yes, as long it is. As we're expressing through our prank <laughs> the kind of conversational nature of what we're trying to achieve. Yes. What are you thinking? I'm, 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 I'm thinking, well, on that thought, I'm thinking giant halls of atonement based on what you're saying. Hall of atonement. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> okay. So, well, I, th I'm most disappointed in impulse, to be honest. And I say disappointed with a, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so I think impulse should be first on our list of halls of atonement to build and I feel like he should acknowledge his sins. Okay. <laughs> so so is the S in impulse SV like sin? And then <laughs> the V is like very bad, never again, Miss Cleo? I, I, the, I, I, the... I, feel, I feel like that's what it should be. So we need to go and help him see the error of his ways. So shall we go to his base? Well, I'm always happy to help people see errors. That's why I work with computers. <laughs> Let's head over there now. And then possessions to the left, you to the right. <laughs> yes, that's that's good. I like that. And then this sign here says, this is not trapped at all. The soul squad. Okay. Okay. So, uh... Well, there it goes again. We need to get a better... <laughs> We'll sort it out at the end. It can stay there for yeah, now. That's fine. <laughs> okay. Um, I was I was gonna say. Now, for those of you guys watching at home who are like, "Why would I watch both of these videos?" Cleo's video is gonna have all the like actual mm. construction stuff, and mine's gonna have all the garbage conversations we have while we're building. <laughs> yes, and we do <laughs> have garbage. My, mine, mine is very much for, more for, forthright than joe's joe has all the stupid things that we say to each other and we do say stupid yeah. things to each other <laughs> so you will get to see this built in both videos but you'll get a very different point of view <laughs> anyway cleo let's go ahead and talk about <laughs> what we're gonna do with that. right well what we're going to do Put right so the ground right impulse has done several very wrong things and there are four wrong things that he is going to do so the first room we're going to go down into this room is going to be the darkness of his soul right now so this is going to be the black room and inside there's going to be a tableau of him trying to kill me in the sh pirate ship and he's gonna there's gonna be two doors one that looks apparently trick I, I think we should probably tell you all there are no tricks in this base he if he goes through this room he's not going to die we're just going to pretend he's going to die which is you know still i think a crime but anyway <laughs> um okay so we're gonna present him with a choice of the <laughs> to apologize for attempting to kill you yes and if yes. he doesn't okay, apologize he actually said those yeah the room on this side is going to look trapped it's not going to be trapped it's going to look trapped um so we're going to go down even further so he's going to atone and then when he gets here he's going to be i didn't buy any curse of binding books i need to go we and buy some curse of binding mall. yeah Perfect we're going to difference. buy we're going to bind something on and on one of these things is going to be a, a, a dropper which um he's going to stand on and drop and and shoot some um bound armor like a helm of repentance or something in this room, this is going to be the hellscape room. Um, and I haven't decided which of the many things that he's going to do is is there. Which are the things that he needs to do? Oh, this is probably the use of poison. You should not You should not use poison. Going to go through. Going to repent. Another piece of bound, bound armor. And then rooms yeah, getting... They must be the boots of not poisoning your friends. The or boots something. of not poisoning your friends. <laughs> something like that, yeah. And then this room can't go that way because there's a, a thing over there because we're in the middle of a ravine, if you couldn't tell. Um, this room is going to be made of bone because um, I've got a huge amount of bone blocks um, from the server. So, yeah, and this is going to be... Um, oh, this is going to be... You shouldn't kill your friends who, who tidy up your mistakes because 
as we all know, I tidied up his his shop after a creeper exploded that spawned inside, which was his fault, because that's how so, that works. So the first room is about murder. Yes. And the sec this room is about betrayal. Yes. So first so room murder, second room poison. Here. Yeah. It's that no. you shouldn't betray your. Yes, that's it. We do not betray our friends. And the last room is <clears throat> arguably the worst thing he's done. Nice big room. They're getting the getting longer as we go down. Um it's I should not summon forth the the, the denizens of hell into the real world effectively. So cause... so in particular they pulled a ghostly ship up from the sunken depths of the sea floor, but with it, they summoned its ghastly inhabitants across planes, trapping them partially in our own physical realm and partially in this kind of hellish, ethereal realm. See, this is why I've got you here, Joe. This is why you're here. <laughs> because I'm good at classifying sins against both man and God. Yes, that's the reason. It's it's not that you can <laughs> you can make stuff up on the fly. That's the reason. It's the sin and, thing. And because I'm the only American, you can wake up this early. In the <laughs> yes, that too. Everybody else just they see the zombie Cleo alarm and they're like, "Nope, call me when it's a bat signal." <laughs> I feel sad now. No, I don't. Um, okay, so that's the plan. I'm going to start building things and we're going to start decorating the rooms and. It, the next time you see this video, Joe will have something on his video of, of a stupid conversation we've had, and I'll have the bit where all the rooms at least are the right colour. Sounds good. Time skip. Oh, I'm actually crying. Oh, God. Oh. Yep, I'm just that kind of friend. <laughs> you do bring me to tears on a regular basis. I try. I know. You succeed. Okay, so we got. Oh, this room is still terrible. <laughs> I have to go back up to get some blocks. It is. It is the worst room. <laughs> like he's gonna get through that. Oh, and then there's the stuff's got my feet on fire again. <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> Yay, British time. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, I did give you the option of when to do this. Yeah, but it had to be a time that Corinne wasn't awake. And so it was either going to be at like 4 a.m. your time, which is looking more and more appealing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, or like 5 a.m. my time. Okay. And we know which one we went for. Yeah. Uh, well, I do. I really like teaching people lessons, so... <laughs> You know, I figured you figured you'd teach yourself risk one. Uninvited. No, I just no. I wanted to build this hall of atonement. <laughs> In the process, you taught yourself a lesson. Don't don't do things Why with the are British there people. here? <laughs> this whole thing is just so bad. <laughs> like I'm gonna add like a what? little lip on this side too. Oh, okay. Um, you've added a door, and now I can't get. Out. Oh, can't you just jump up oh, on the map? Oh, there floor? we go. Oh, thanks, lava. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sorry. I I hadn't gotten the other blocks in yet. Yeah, no problem. no problem. Oh, well, turns out you can't put redstone blocks here. Because <laughs> they stick the door open. <laughs> there are other blocks. There are other blocks. Oh. <laughs> oh. Flip. Oh. Not laughed this much in ages. It's great. Hang on, I've got some netherrack. I'll come bring you some netherrack. Do, do you have um? Do you have like one of those spark flint things? I want to light this. Oh, I put some um. I can make one. You, yeah, I, I put a redstone block underneath the magma block that has the signs on it, and I wanted to put a fire underneath that. It'll make sense when you get here. Oh, oh, okay. Those blooming steps, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Everything. <laughs> what are you doing? This is the bad 
loud voice. <laughs> okay, Joe, flint and steel. Okay, there you go. cool. <laughs> 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 oh, those stupid step. <laughs> oh, oh, ow. Dad, I just did this. <laughs> Uh... Okay, Claire. <laughs> a video about Minecraft. We have. Okay, how do y'all? Okay. Struggles. Right. Deep breaths. Right, so we're going to show you exactly what's going to happen. Well, not exactly because it's not finished yet, uh, but Joe needs to go and I need some more help. So I'm going to have to call in somebody else, I think, at some point. Um, so. Joe, would you like to explain what happens at this point? So, right here, we have built a place for Impulse to part ways with his possessions. This is a thoroughly 100% untrapped rail line. Any sort of visual inspection will back up that assessment. Look, there's no redstone. There's no way we're going to blow up his things with like a TNT cannon pointed at it from either of these two cliffs. I mean, that would be a mathematical and parabolical impossibility. Improbability. I'm lazy. I'm not going to do it. Trust <laughs> us. Um, if he so doesn't that, trust us. Well, then he's not going to get the full experience. <laughs> okay. And then we go into the room of nightmares, which has caused Joe significant emotional trauma. Already. This room is very disturbing. It's actually worse than Mumbo's or uh, Grian's little white space room. Because with this room, you can tell that there's stuff. You just can't always tell where it is. Um, but do, would you like to read the sign, Cleos? Yes. Read the last one? Welcome to the attempted murder room. Murder is wrong. Failure is also undesirable. Don't ever murder or fail ever again. And so press this button to apologize and proceed. I was wrong to attempt to kill and fail. And then he goes through. And then down here... We get the, we're going to put in the, one of these armor pieces, the helm of success, and he'll get that put onto his body. Down. Because we don't want him to be a failure ever again. No. You, it's your turn. We need to panoplize him for the future. So this is called, welcome to the don't poison people room. <laughs> if you're trying to cleverly define people, take a step back. <laughs> don't poison Poisons are like toxins with bad intentions. And then this sign doesn't have any text on. No. Which I should probably fix. <laughs> this is this is Joe's thought process is live. I mean every episode is Joe's thought process is live. This sign intentionally blank. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't make me laugh. I've got such a bad cough. I apologize for deploying dangerous poison in a joking way. <laughs> and then there's another bit for the, I believe it's the plate of potability because it's the opposite of poison. Yes. Welcome. For those of you who are yeah, kids, po uh, potability means water is safe to drink. Welcome to the room of betrayal. Tomorrow's future, today. 100% of true friendships don't end in betrayal. Be a true friend to all. And this is, I apologise for betraying my friend who helped me. And then there's Joe's rabbit head that he hasn't taken away yet. Because he's forgotten it. <laughs> yeah. I'll, and, I'll pick it up. I got it. You got it. You got it. And then this one is for the trousers of truth. That's going to come down here. And Joe, would you like to do the final room? Sure. <laughs> Welcome to the room of respect for the dead and their realms. Summoning a ship of the dead from the depths disturbs graves. We had a lot of fun today, but disturbing graves is a real problem. Stranding ghosts between the physical and spirit worlds is bad. I wanted that sentence to be better, but the, the sign just wouldn't. It, it's just bad. It's just, we'll, we'll just bad. It. Let's just move on. It's fine. We should clarify at this point, there's a lot of free space here because Cleo is going to put tableaus in this. Yeah, this there's going to be just... like di little dioramas in here. It's going to be fine. Um, yeah, okay, I need, so I'll need i need some help, I think. That's fine. Sure. I apologize for running a spectral vessel aground. I accept responsibility for all damages to the restful dead. I will aspire to ascendant behavior in all things. And then and we'll walk then, through here. Oh, you need the... 
the pressure plate because we're going to put in the boots of boundaries, specifically the boundaries between the living and the dead. There we I go. And yeah, then, like, I... well, you can only get back one way. That's fine. And then fine. he will drown, apparently. Why does this not work? Because you've... You... I put kelp in there. Where's the kelp? I, well, no, the kelp dies when you switch out the dirt block. But, like, yeah, I put kelp in there and then I broke the kelp. But, like... Well, that's because magma block pulls... No, it doesn't. It pushes you up, doesn't it? Are you sure it's not soul sand that pushes you up? I think it's soul sand that pushes okay, you up. Okay, I will go and grab soul sand and we'll back be right back after these messages. I wasn't recording that, but now I have slime in my inventory. We're in the slime chunk, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so, Honestly, him having to punch his way through a few slimes would not <laughs> he could he could survive that because he'll already have most of the armor by that point. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> so um yeah, you're gonna soul sand this? I will soul sand this. And then soul sand. Where did it go? I literally just put it in there. Oh it's there. Okay, fine. Right. Wasn't where I thought it was going to be. Ah, Joe! <laughs> I don't know how Minecraft works. Right, so can... Oh, there we go. Whee! <laughs> Aspire to ascendant behavior in all things. And thank you, Mumbo, for, 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 for the uh, appropriate light change. Yay. Is there a... um? I was gonna say, should we just have this dump him out here? Like, yes. Just, just like not provide any sort of. Where's it like, gone? The, it's there. The, it comes out right here. Yeah, it's just like it just pops out. It's like I think I know where I am. <laughs> yeah. It's like we gave you enough spiritual direction. Find your own way home. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna get a sign that says that because yes. I like it too much. <laughs> Why is my elytra not working? Stupid bunny hat. Oh, it's because Mumbo's online. It's funny, I always say that as well. And people go, why do you always say that? Because I it's say it because true. you say it. It's because it's true. <laughs> Two hours of recording and it's so early still. <laughs> uh, my whole body is in pain. Well, it sounds like my daughter just woke up. So Zombie Cleo. Hey, Corinne, do you want to say hi to Zombie Cleo? I didn't i've been up for a while <laughs> I'm waiting for you to wake up well i've been playing video games <laughs> hi corinne I need food. okay well i gotta go get corinne her meal until next time cleo and y'all this is joe hills from nashville tennessee bye joe and corinne. and corinne bye corinne hi jev hello um you may be wondering why i've called you here to the steps of misery uh, it's probably not good. So, <laughs> okay. can you tell me that you have pizza and ice cream in there, and it's not going to be bad? Um, I mean, no pizza, no, no ice no. cream, uh, but there is yeah. a lot of judgment. Oh God. <laughs> okay. okay. So let's go back to the beginning because I don't know how much you know. So, um, false was pranked by. I mean, sure, sure, you know this bit. Yeah, I know that bit. Okay. Well, I changed the sign to implicate Ren, and then, uh -huh. and then, uh, false and Grian pranked Ren. Ren then pulled together Doc and Impulse to prank me, and that's that's where my involvement comes back around again, which is why we're here because I've got a prank Impulse back because <laughs> yeah. I expected it of the other two. Didn't yeah, expect yeah. it of Impulse, um, but then. Um, this uh, Joe came and helped me, so Joe's part of this whole thing as well. So, um, since Joe's left and I've asked you to come and help me, um, I've lo been looking around, and so apparently they changed the signs on the prank on my base, or somebody has, I'm not sure who it was, to get Grian and do okay. it on his base. So Grian is now because of because uh, because of Doc and. <laughs> 
Christ. He's now <laughs> um, stolen all the diamonds in the vault in the thing. It's a whole mess. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So you're telling me that the vault and the stock exchange got robbed? Yes. Did oh, you not know that? Hell no. <laughs> hell no. Oh, I'm yeah, they're sure all yours. The, I'm not sure if I want to be mad at the person that's stolen them because of the you know, heist or mm. if I want to be mad at Doc and Ren because of the lack of security. I mean, if you go in that place, they've got a god dang, you know. Oh, the jacuzzi um, pool. Yeah, the jacuzzi pool. Like, oh, you need to security? go and see. You need to go and see how easy it was from Green's video. Better yet, to ask Green how easy it was. Green just went da 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 da, and it worked. That he got oh, in. Oh my god! It's so easy to get into that yeah. place. I'm I'm not even mad at Green because you know if he was good enough to do that, it's I I need to have a talk with uh, Ren and Doc for sure I, with I, my sword probably. Okay, <laughs> well that's that's. That's your end of the prank war. But <laughs> I, I've taken the impulse side. That's fine. I'll deal with it. You can help me with impulse and then... Uh, All right, let's go. All right. Okay, so the steps of atonement. So basically, we're going to ask impulse to um, part press ways with his possessions. And there's a sign out there that says, um, if you if you don't trust your friends, etc., etc., etc. Okay. So yes, then we're going to ask him to be cleansed. And we're going sort of through... The, through hell to atonement at this point. Oh my god! Because he's done this full prank. Things. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, but go this for prank it. has Joe all over it. Well, I did <laughs> this bit, and then Joe did all the signs because. Okay. Yeah, just take a look at the signs. Welcome to the attempted murder room. Murder is wrong. Failure to un uh, failure is also undesirable. Don't murder or fail ever again. Yes, and, <laughs> and this room is really disorientating. Joe hates this room. Um, and oh then it's God, press yeah, the is... button to apologize and proceed. I was wrong to attempt to kill and fail. Okay, we're going to take these buttons out from this side of the door so he can he can't go back. And then when we go over this pressure plate, um, this will be the last mm. thing I put in. I'm going to put in like um, curse of binding. There's the helm oh, of God. success. So yeah. that's awesome. And it's it's a yellow helm, uh, an orange t-shirt, lime green pants, and <sighs> something pink boots. I think. Oh my God, this gonna love that. So that that's going to be one piece. And then you come down to the hellfire <laughs> room. This is the don't poison people room. We'll we'll go through it at the end, and then. <laughs> I apologize. I like that. <laughs> just straight up. Just just don't poison people. I mean, it's just rude. Um, yeah. And I like this sign. If you're trying to cleverly define people, take a step back. <laughs> oh my god. Oh okay. My god. And again, coming back through, there is another I thing. I apologize for deploying dangerous potions in a joking way. <laughs> and then there's another curse of binding thing here. You see, uh -huh. the rooms are getting progressively lighter. Oh yeah, well, welcome to the room of betrayal. Tomorrow's feature today. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's feature that's another. Of, uh, all. Okay. Okay, so right, and then we go. I apologize for bringing my friend, betraying my friend who helped me because I literally just helped him fix up eye trade that got wow. creepers. So <laughs> I say helped him. Rude. I kind of did it on my own back, and yeah, then yeah. another curse of binding, <clears throat> and. Welcome to the room of respect for the dead and their realms. Because of the ghost ship. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Summoning a ship of the dead in the depths to disturb the graves. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. And, yeah. okay, and then I will aspire to ascendant behavior in all things. So you go through there, it takes him up and deposits him on the surface in his uh, Curse of Binding gear, but nothing else. That's awesome. Right. Yeah, okay. So what we need is for each of these rooms is like a little mini uh stand tableau you know the drill so we okay. need to figure out okay. what it is we are doing for each of these rooms because this hmm. is the rooms of the ghosts so i'm expecting it to just be haunted by a lot of ghosts yeah and maybe also just this like, is a slime trunk so be warned maybe like uh like some floating heads in here or something oh yeah i've got loads of heads upstairs i'll show yeah. you my support lies in awesome. here awesome. okay right. floating heads in here and up Back to the room of Owl. Ow. Not the room of Owl. The room of, I, I, for some reason, I got hurt. Okay, the room of um, uh, Betrayal. Hmm. I Bones. was thinking... What do we do for this one? Well, I was thinking doing stabbing people in the back. 
Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a really good one. Yeah, so we can just have some someone. I don't have any of his heads. I've got some gems though. I can go get some. I oh can yeah, have yeah, impulse stabbing me in the back and do stuff like that. Um, the next one down here. Um, don't poison th people. I am not sure what to do for this hmm. room. What do you think? Um, I don't know. I mean, we could have someone kamikazing in throwing potions. That could work. Yeah. That's that's gonna be you doing that one though. That's a hard one. I don't. I don't okay, I'll do that one. one. That's fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm um, good at using the signs, just not that good. Okay, mm -hmm. and in this one, this one's really difficult, um, because it's really so this disorientating. Is a room of attempted murder. Maybe just have some floating swords. Ooh. Oh, I like that good. theory. That's a good yeah. one. That would totally work. That would totally work. The attempted murder room. Okay. So if I start in the the, the potion throwing room and I get heads, yeah. how many heads do we need? So I would say, I mean, that room's not that big. Maybe four. Okay. Let, let's go up here. We'll, we'll, we'll just do it from the stock I've got. And then the stabbing me in the back thing and the... Watch the step. <laughs> we put the step in. Well, we put the step in because the cart kept on being pushed away because we were going up this block. And then yeah. Joe and then Joe got fed up with me keeping on knocking it back. <laughs> so in the red boxes, this red box specifically, I've got my skulls that we can use. Do you have armor stands on you already? I do have 16 armor stands. We're going to need some okay, more. Perfect. And I've got some slabs here. And um, I can do the heads if you want to start working on maybe the, or I can do the swords too. That works too. Yeah. If you do the swords and the heads and I'll start working on the other room and I will right. get, <sighs> I will go and get some me heads. If that makes sense. Okay. Um, me, me and impulse heads. I think that will work. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. Let's break for a minute and then we'll be back. And when we started. Perfect. Hello, Jeff. Do you like what you see? Oh, did I, did I'm recording you? now. <laughs> you did a bit. Oh, Oh, Sorry. let's see what we got here. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, that, that's awesome. Do you, um, oh, that's going to be poisons. Okay, so you're going to throw a potion on there. Yeah, so I'm going to poison. He's going to do that, and I'm going to have one just sort of. I was going to say, maybe make one floating. float. Yeah, floating yeah. in the ground. As, uh, floating in the I ground. I am working upstairs on making some floating swords. Let's me, let's me look. Let me let me look. So I'm trying to do, I'm going to do a bunch of them in different positions. Like, so this one right here, I'm just going to pick probably some sort of random positioning. Random like position. maybe lunge. Oh, it didn't do it. Is uh, it locked? No. Let's do death. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah. That would definitely uh, kill you having your torso ripped from your legs like that. Definitely. Attention. No, that's ugly. Let's do uh, winning. That, okay. Winning is nothing, apparently. Um, I don't know what that is, but I'm doing I'm just, it. Uh, I think you might oh, actually that, be affecting right this there, one. Yeah. <laughs> I think you might so be affecting then... this one. Oh, those are locked, though. Are you sure? Okay, fair enough. Yeah, I'm 100% sure. And then we'll just uh, hide stand. I'm not as fast as you at this, so don't don't hate <laughs> Oh, I'm it, not okay? judging. I'm not judging. It's fine. Maybe I am affecting that one. Check target. No, it's tech checking that one. Stand visible. No. Well, what? There we I... go. Oh. I'm gonna <laughs> now oh, you've given it your my... book. Hey. Sorry, give me that back. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't judge. There we go. Locked. I'm not judging. So I just I just it. find it funny. So I'm going to make like like three more of these because i don't have any more armor stands after that so oh uh, well um there's wood and um slabs in the chests outside so yeah. feel free to what um what i might try to do is like on the stairs like maybe right here is yeah. do like two armor stands saluting Ooh. where they like crosses as two swords perfect that sounds really good yeah. okay break that guys <laughs> Okay, right, so we're done, yeah? Yes. More or less. I've just got to put the binding things in. I suggest we go. you go ahead of me before I do that. Okay, Full so... Full disclosure, chat. Full disclosure, okay? <laughs> I did, like, one and a half rooms. She did, like, <laughs> eight or nine, so... Considering there are four rooms, I, th I felt up. very accomplished. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> but right, Jevin so, did this room. I mean, this, this was cool. I like this, the cross swords. Yeah, I think besides it being turned a little weird, I like it a lot, though. Yeah, mm -hmm. so this is the murder room. Murder is wrong. Failure is also undesirable. Don't fail. Yes. So, yep, yeah, murder room. Okay, so, Jev, if you go ahead down the path. Okay. And, and if I take this plate out... She's they taking can't... the plate out, and then right. she's going to put armor in the stand here. Yep, yeah, I am going to put the yellow Curse of Binding Helm of Success, because we want him to be successful in his future. Yeah. Okay, and moving on. Down we go. To the Don't Poison yeah. People room. This um, is really cool looking. I like that. That's me running away and then him throwing poisons on me. I apologize for deploying poisons in a dangerous way. Okay. He's um, not apologetic. Oh, he will be. That's why he's pressing the buttons. <laughs> that's how it works. And then in this one, I am going to put the plate of potability because potable things okay. are not poisonous. Of course. And the room of betrayal. 100%. Look how cool this looks, guys. Seriously, she's really good at this stuff. I love, I love this. I love the fact that he's just genuinely stabbing me in the back like a monster. You know what would be, like, really awesome? If uh, these could, like, remember scenes. So, like, scene one would be, like, him standing there and scene two would be stabbing. That way you oh. could, like, run redstone to it. That would be amazing. That would be cool. I, I will speak to Pushpok and see if he can implement that. Yeah. And he'll go, go away. Because that would be sensible. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Okay, after you. I'm going to take this crafting right, bench down, down as well. Go. Oh, did so I take... The... I did not take the button off the last room, did I? So we could go back. I don't know. I'm going to go back and try and make sure that I don't get hit with the Curse of Binding item. Right, yeah. Take that out. Or just, I was going to say, take it out, yeah. There we go. Guys, full disclosure, I'm using a new keyboard, so if you see me keep messing up, which you have like 10 times already, <laughs> that's why. Okay. I keep hitting the wrong button and putting items into my offhand slot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, you, you first. And then me. And I take away this button. And then I put in this the trousers of truth. Oh my god. <laughs> that's funny. All right, guys, so this is the headroom, and we used phantoms heads uh, because these are, like, really kind of creepy. Yes, they and also kind of called phantoms. Also yeah. called phantoms, and this is the uh, standing ghost between stranding ghost between the physical and spirit worlds is bad room. Okay, yeah. would you like to take the ascension path? Yeah, let's go. Right, you go. And I will put in to this dispenser... The boots, oh God, of boundaries. And boots of boundaries. Up we go. We. And it just. That is all direct. All the direction good you get. Find your way home. Cleo's name deserves to be listed first, then Joe Hills. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Hills did the signs. Uh, oh my God. Joe is something else. He is something man. else. And we are done with that prank. Yay. Yay. I think you need to go and speak to Grian. I am going to go talk to Green and then maybe even Doc with my sword because Ren's going on vacation. <laughs> yes, that's probably a preferable way of doing it. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. First, though, first, though, we've got to get to the bottom of this heist. So because I want my diamonds back. Yeah, um, it's not safe there, at least. No, and no, definitely not. If Green's stolen your diamonds, then he's got your diamonds. So, yeah. OK, thank you for awesome. helping me. I'll catch no you later. Yep, see you later. Bye.